bottom of League One Shrewsbury Town faced a tough trip to the Fylde Coast as they took on a Fleetwood Town side just outside the playoff places in the same division. A trip to Bristol City awaited the winner in round three. Enough of a carrot to see the visitors take the lead just before half time. Ex Fleetwood wingback Junior Brown's hopeful ball over the top fell to Jim O'Brien, who finished definitively to open the scoring. But the task of holding on to that lead became all the harder when visiting captain Adam El Abd dragged down a flying Aaron Amadi Holloway five minutes into the second half, leaving referee Mark Haywood with no other option than to reduce the shrews to ten men with nearly 40 minutes to play. Fleetwood saw their opportunity to get back in the game when captain Nathan Pond nodded towards goal, only to be denied by a superb reaction save from Jason Lutweiler. However, the numerical disadvantage didn't stop the Shrews from going further in front. Louis Dodds finishing coolly and doubling the Shrews' lead. However, Fleetwood had never failed to score at home in the FA Cup in ten previous games in the competition proper, and true to form gave themselves a chance of turning the tie around when Devante Cole rose highest to reduce the deficit just three minutes later. And with 13 minutes remaining, Alex Ken's speculative punt was flicked on by Amadi Holloway, the ball crashing into Chris Long before bouncing kindly for Cole. His finish put Fleetwood level with a grandstand finish on the cards. And it didn't disappoint. Five minutes into injury time, Uwe Rosler's side found the goal to put them in front for the first time in the match. Long's layoff was steered in by super sub Ashley Hunter. His ninth goal of the season was the seventh time he'd come from off the bench to find the net. The drama wasn't over yet, with virtually the last kick of the game. Shrewsbury could and perhaps should have forced extra time. The ball into the box panicked the Fleetwood defenders, and some quick feet between Brown and Dodds gave Ivan Tony the space to shoot. The woodwork coming to the rescue for Fleetwood and sending them into the third round, but only the second time in their history. 3-2 the final score. Next up for Rosler's men, a trip to Ashton Gates.